widely considered one of the most significant hot rods ever built, the Don Spencer Deuce took the inaugural first place in the Pebble Beach Concourse de Elegance hot rod class, has enjoyed numerous wins at Amelia Island, Meadowbrook Hall, and the Louis Vuitton Classic, and currently spends most of its time in the prestigious Peterson Automotive Museum. It seems only fitting that if someone wanted to build a professionally finished hot rod which benchmarks the best custom on the planet, Don Spencer's Ford would be the car to study. And that's exactly what the previous owner of this striking 1932 Roadster did. Don Spencer's actual deuce is not surprisingly covered in a sinister coat of traditional Ford black. That's definitely a distinctive look, but this car's builder had something a little brighter in mind. After the car's streamlined supplied body was stripped to its bare essence and ground smooth, it received a stunning combination of dark blue base and glossy clear. There's a ton of depth in that finish, which was likely achieved through a regimen of wet sanding and paint layering. Panel fitment is impressive for a modified body as every seam is laser straight, and the result is one super clean custom that absolutely glows in natural light. Like the original Dome Spencer Deuce, this car is powered by a Mercury Flathead V8 that's every bit as streetable as it is cool. Unlike the original Dome Spencer Deuce, this car's flathead is a Mercury 59A block that's been bored, stroked, ported, and relieved to 300 cubic inches. On top of that timeless red power plant, a polished hexagon air cleaner funnels air through two coated Holly tube barrels. A coated hexagon intake supplies air and fuel to milled Offenhauser heads that are sandwiched between oversized valves and pristine polished covers. And coated Headman headers dump spent gases into 3-inch mandrel bent pipes. Open the doors and you can watch the car's classic good looks flow right through its stylish Duval windshield and manifest as a supple Ferrari leather cockpit. There's a 1948 Cadillac bench seat that's firm, supportive, and equipped with the correct folding armrest. In front of that seat, a correct engine turn dash hangs a full assortment of Stuart Warner gauges above the car's Schroeder steering system and an original spoon accelerator pedal and a simple wheel antique steering wheel circles a vintage overdrive handle. From its liquid smooth paint to its top-notch drivetrain, this classic deuce combines undeniable swagger with unbeatable exclusivity. And when you throw in the car's cool backstory, six-figure budget, and world-class build, it becomes one highly desirable hot rod that signifies the very best of custom car culture. If you're a die-hard gearhead who fantasizes about the glory days of innovative car builders, this little piece of SoCal treasure is a dream come true. For more information, call, click, or visit rkmotorcharlotte.com.